สวัสดีครับผู้ชมทุกท่าน Hello, welcome to day 7's lesson of five words a day program. I will at the beginning mention the lesson requirements, go through the five words that we learn new today, and then we'll have a look at the sentences. Lesson requirements. Read and write Thai. 1 to 21 is what you need in order to understand and follow this lesson. And then you will have to learn lesson 1 to 6 or go through lesson 1 to 6 and learn the words that are belonging to those lessons in order to be able to follow the structure sentences of lesson 7. Vocabulary for today is Krai Ben Kao Te Gap Krai เป็นเขาเธอ and กับ translation ใคร means who or who as a question Ben translates as to be and in brackets here I have characteristics because there are different uh, translations in Thai of the word to be which is a there is a locational to be as we have learned before which is as you recall, of course, you. And then there is to be as a characteristic of a certain person or a more, a more like general to be, which is Ben. And then there is a third one that we learn later on. Kao means he. Or whatever form of he, of course. Him, his, whatever. Te, accordingly, means she or her, or whatever form of she. Then, gap means with or and. Sentences. Pa, gap, me, you, ti, ban. Father and mother are at home, or are in the house, at the house. เขาเป็นใคร He is who or who is he? เธอมีเงินมากเงินอยู่ในเมือง She has a lot of money and additionally to that the money is in the city. ใคร Ben Pa Kong Kao, who is the father of him, or who is his father? Te Ben Me Cry, or after the the and the the whatever you call that, <laughs> a second way to express the exact same sentence just using a little bit more of complementary words เธอเป็นแม่ของใคร so basically แม่ใคร and แม่ของใคร is the same thing in Thai and Thais uh, love to keep it simple and short so they would colloquially rather use the first sentence than the second, but both are equally correct. So I read it again. First version, เธอเป็นแม่ใคร or เธอเป็นแม่ของใคร Same meaning. คุณไปตลาดกับใคร You go to the market with whom? So with whom do you go to the market? Or who do you go to the market with? ฉันไปดูหนังกับเขาในเมือง I go to watch a movie with him in the city and here what we can already experience a little bit is the verb serialization which means verbs being put after each other which is very frequently used in Thai 
like I go watch. So go to watch and then sometimes we have three words after each other and it can sometimes be a bit tricky to figure it out at the beginning but here you see because we do not have any uh, conjugation in Thai so uh, as you, you might have in German for instance so it's just always uh, the verb as it is stated in the yeah in in the general form so by do to go to watch me by the lot pa mother goes to the market with father pa gap me to by nai or pa gap me kong te by ti nai both sentences again with the same meaning just the one to the right is a bit more specific of the actual words that are implied in the first sentence but then again the first sentence which is the one to the left is already a bit a little bit more colloquial so i read those two versions again exact same meaning pa gap me te so father and mother of her by nai go where where do they go or to the right again pa gap me kong te bai thi nai exact same meaning krai ben kon pud who is the person speaking who is speaking Hong Ni Kong Krai. This room belongs to whom? Whose room is it? Again, I read all the sentences from top till down, starting with the first one. And you try to reinforce uh, what you've learned during this lesson and try to recapulate basically the meaning of each sentence. พ่อกับแม่อยู่ที่บ้านเขาเป็นใครเธอมีเงินมากเงินอยู่ในเมืองใครเป็นพ่อของเขาเธอเป็นแม่ใคร or เธอเป็นแม่ของใครคุณไปตลาดกับใครฉันไปดูหนังกับเขาในเมืองแม่ไปตลาดกับพ่อพ่อกับแม่เธอไปไหน or พ่อกับแม่ของเธอไปที่ไหนใครเป็นคนพูด and here I think I translated it as who is the person speaking but it could also mean who said it who 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 was the person saying some particular thing who said this just as a side note again and the last one Hong Ni Hong Krai all right thank you for joining this lesson thank you for learning Thai because I'm an absolute let's say I'm a, I'm a big fan of this language and I hope to bring something across that you may profit from. สวัสดีครับ